Well, there was one segment of the market that didn't fare nearly as well as the rest, uh, which this time happened to be West Route. And uh, hello again, this is John James with the James team at Remax Partners with a number, another uh, Steamboat Market update. Uh, but we're doing West Route Market update for April of 2020. And yeah, it's a, you know, the market in West Route for Hayden the Cog, around 20 mile road and all that didn't do fairly it didn't fare nearly as well as you know some of the other places in the valley um the one bright spot i think is the median sold price and that is still up from last year which was uh, 327,500 it is up about 11.7 percent from uh 293,250 same time last year so that is still kind of a nice trend line that we see that the prices are still rising over there. Uh, but the number of sales were certainly down. Uh, it was 58 sales in April for West Route, and that's down 17.1% from the 70 that we saw last year. And also the sales volume was down too. <clears throat> so, you know, there weren't as many sales, not a lot of sales volume, but that regular median sales price was up. So the sales volume was 17,705,365, down about 13.9% from uh, about 20 and a half million in April of 2019. So, you know, there's not as many higher priced places in the West Route area. You know, we've seen some stuff with the new new subdivisions like Dry, you know, Dry Lake and uh and what Lakeview so those you know those we'll see as they come on that might change a little bit more of the volume uh, days on market that was up as well but that's not it's it's not that much of a surprise it's been going up just about everywhere else uh, it was 31 days compared to 26 days last year that's a 19.2 percent change month supply it's still in the sellers market range so anything under six months is seller's market anything over buyer's market if it's right around the middle it's a stable market it was four and a half months that's up 18.4 percent from the 3.8 months in april of 2019 so if we were to take everything in west route and try to sell it all um it would take four and a half months to do one nice little bright spot the active listings were up it was up uh, 24 uh from 21 so up three it was a percentage of 14.3% increase, um, but it's good to see more and more listings coming on the market. We just still have quite a low inventory. And another bright spot is the sales to list price ratio. That is 98.4%. So only a very small drop from the list price. You know, if the list price was a uh, hundred percent, you know, you're getting well, maybe 1.6% off of that. That's up 0.7% from the 97.7% in April 2019. A couple of COVID stats. Uh, don't have the back of mar uh, back on market um, on there, but I do have the stat for the pending listings. That was up by one, so it was 69 this year, 68 last year. It's up by you know point and a half percent. And also, you know, what is the difference between March and April? Uh, March and April this year, it was down 3.3% for a number of sales. And that's a little change from being up 2.9% from March to April in 2019. And then finally, the sales volume, the sales volume was down 3.1% for March to April of this year. Um, so we're looking at that as a COVID stat. And compared to March to April in 2019, that's up 2.3%. So you add that up, that's a 5.4% differential between March and April of each year. So we will see as next week we start to get in all of the May stats, where things kind of stand now that we've had a full month of the safer at home guidelines as opposed to the stay at home guidelines. Uh, other news is we now have the restaurants open uh, at 50% capacity and uh, with social distancing, of course, and then encouraging 
as much outside seating as possible. So we're very happy about that. And also the Route County Commissioners are welcoming back the second homeowners who have been kind of staying away and waiting to come in. Um, they're now wholeheartedly welcome. As I said, Route County is not the same without you. And the short-term lodging ban has lapsed as of today. So looking forward to seeing what happens in June. I'm looking forward to giving you those stats. If you have any questions, please give me a call. 970-846-0797 or email me at johnjames at jamesteamsteamboat.com. Have a great day. Hey everybody, um, I am really happy that you got a chance to take a look at this. If you want to get uh, these updates on a regular basis on YouTube, um, please hit the like and subscribe button. Um, you know, hit that little bell so you know when, uh, when these updates drop. I'm trying to do these on a much more regular basis, so I'm trying to get it out there as much as possible so you have the information you need to you know, make the decisions about either buying a home here in Steamboat or uh, whether it's time to sell. So again, like and subscribe and look forward to seeing you on the next one. Take care.